I yeah. got good rhythm. I used to play the drums and the guitar. Give us a sneak peek. Yeah, Come clap it real quick. It's like... <laughs> it hurt the first time it went in. When she put it in the first time, it almost tore me in half. No, I'm just kidding. Inconsiderate or needy, Ian? There needs to be more empathy on both sides. Whack. Inconsiderate. <laughs> Welcome back to Under the Influence. We've got a very special episode today. <laughs> the fuck was that? It was my evil hey, laugh. No cussing, no cussing, oh yeah, no, no cussing. cussing. We want to make some money on this episode <laughs> because it's a big one. Uh man, it's so it's. I feel I pressure just, trying to. I just want to wanna say it. I just, just want to come out. No, no, no. You got to build it up. We're okay. about to tell y'all a crazy secret. Something crazy. Something crazy. Wait, what is it about? <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, I was like, I can't tell she's Me joking. and Vin are dating. <laughs> 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 yeah, for the past year, we've been making out behind camera. Secretly fucking. Ha, right, ha, ha. Do, it on, do it on camera now. Anyways, you want to, you wanna, I'm going to let you say it because it's a big moment for y'all right now. So, as my name is Vitrap. <laughs> my name is Wutok. My name is Esther. My name is Jeremy, and we are sponsored by Nectar, Nectar Hard Seltzer. Seltzer. Unique Asian flavors, no weird aftertaste. Get the Paradise Pack link in bio. I'm Anyways. literally so nervous about this that I forgot that we do like an intro. Oh, and we got Ian behind the camera. He doesn't have a camera yet, he hasn't been promoted to camera, but he has a mic. Ian, Say speak. hi, Ian. Hello. There That's you go. Ian. Why are you nervous? Huh? Why are you nervous? Who, me? Yeah, you. So big day for me. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, should, should I just say? Go it? ahead. I'll just go ahead, Jeremy. So as you guys know, um, you know, Esther is taking a fancy to me, but who wouldn't? You know. But we've actually been dating for a whole year. Secretly year. dating. They lied to you for a whole. What they year. fucking and lied to you. Just letting you know, I didn't lie to you guys because I wanted to. This guy wanted to keep me a secret. Jeremy was embarrassed. And, and, Why are you so loud, man? <laughs> <laughs> He's excited. Hey, I'm excited. Ian, turn him down a little. This bit. is a big moment for me, man. Yeah, listen. Uh, no, I think for me it was always that I wanted. What is that term where it's like you want it private but not pub? Not private, private but not, not secret. secret. That's that's what it is. It's called a lie. No, no, you were completely secret. <laughs> yeah, no, I was completely yeah, yeah. secret because here's why. First, when when she started taking an interest, uh-huh. should we just, like okay, so no, in, I've got questions prepared, but okay, like okay. what? Just start with why did you feel that you wanted to keep it private? Because one, there's a work relationship. We started off as a work relationship, so that uh-huh. could get extremely sticky. Uh-huh. So as, I had as, to know. As it does sometimes. Would you say? <laughs> would you say? <laughs> it's rainbows and butterflies, my friend. <laughs> Um, but, but two, but number two, number two, um, why are y'all sitting? This is the farthest I've seen y'all sit from each other and, and you're coming We're out mad at each other right now. <laughs> she's, she's, she's hey, but the show me. must go on. <laughs> so no, but number two was that if it didn't work out for whatever reasons, then I would never have to publicize it and it would just, we'd go on with our lives. Show yeah. it can, show oh, you don't want to milk your relationship for views? Nah, ain't about that life. I wouldn't want to do that Motherfucker, you should have gotten to a different industry than you're on a <laughs> podcast. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. I have some, I, I have some boundaries in relation, in relation to a relationship, especially now that we're in the public eye, mm. but she disagrees with me on them, but we fight about it secretly. <laughs> <laughs> What are what are those disagreements? Like he you meant to say that I was ugly, but he had to say all that long stuff. Damn, is that what you meant? Yeah. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. Shit. I just don't ever want to be making like I don't I don't feel like uh, some of my life I want to keep private, and I don't feel like I owe people answers. And I think that once you start talking more about your relationship mm. publicly, like there could be things that happen that the audience doesn't know about, and then they take sides or whatever. Yeah, yeah I agree with that. Yeah, and I never want to be in a position where I have to I have mm-hmm. to put her on blast. And you no, know, I'm just kidding. All right, man. Can you sit down? Audience, viewers, please try to respect our boundaries. And please allow us to make our own decisions. Don't come at him. Don't come at me. Come at her. (laughs) Maybe come at him when he's being a douche, you know, but, but in a nice way. But uh, so I totally agree with that. When when you guys first said that you were you didn't want to like publicize it, I was like, what the fuck? Why? But I totally get it because I can easily see the comments like you guys are in an argument. If we make it too 
mm-hmm. like open on the podcast. Everyone's going to have their own opinion. Like it already annoys me when they have an opinion on something stupid, like what flavor ice cream is the best. <laughs> and then, uh, so yeah, I can only imagine. But today I have convinced them. We have convinced them to answer any and every question that me and Mr. Trap have prepared for the lovely secret couple that have been lying to you for a year. Remember that. <laughs> Remember that. What, what is, what's your guys' anniversary? Um, it was, we started, we made it official in like December. December you, what? I don't, mid, I don't mid know. Mid-December? You don't know either? Maybe it was like, maybe it was like, maybe it was like, maybe it was like Christmas time or something Hey, low-key, like I remember coming back from, uh, can, Coming back from ayahuasca, yeah, and you said that you had a lot of thoughts about your your relationship with with Esther after yeah. that. That show was funny, and yeah. I think you guys started officially dating like right after that. Yeah, sometime around that. So that was mid December. That was mid December. Mid December. Okay. Because yeah. I remember I left to New York for a month right after, mm-hmm. so I left so, December nineteenth. Yeah, we've been dating before that, but not official until yeah, yeah, like yeah. December. It was December. What, what is what does dating mean? You guys don't have a anniversary. I don't give a fuck about that, man. I'm just like uncommon, but okay. You what? No, Wait. I'm saying, I'm saying, should we tell where it started? Wait, do you care? Like, yeah, yeah, I'm about time? to get, we're about to get into why don't, it. Why don't, oh, oh, we're about to get. Yeah, into you guys it. keep fucking oh, talking. If you would let me do my job, this is our episode. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, you're, you're being interviewed. We're the interviewers. Okay, what's up? All right. Hey, you would never talk to your guests like that. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Thank you so for inviting us. So what if they were pissing me off like this? <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait one day for. <laughs> thank you for inviting us. You're yes, welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. I'm we're happy to open up our platform to y'all. The Vit and Wu Talk Show. Thank you. Imagine a show with just us two. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, so I want to start from the beginning, beginning, because obviously the audience has seen Esther basically harassing Jeremy, but they didn't know it was reciprocated. Mm-hmm. Esther's not a creep, y'all. <laughs> and uh, and then, um, so Esther, when did you actually realize you were starting to like Jeremy? Okay, it was super random. I have told this story to all of you guys many times. But not on the podcast, Yeah, right? yeah. yeah. Okay, Hold so- my hand. <laughs> it's, the opposite. Actually, it's, it's actually the opposite she's guys. actually mad at me right now in real life which really? is why about what yeah, yeah, about, <laughs> she'll always be mad should at we, me should we talk about that first or do you want to start with your origin let's start with your origin story when did yeah, you realize yeah, you were yeah. starting okay, to like Jeremy okay. so um, we were on the podcast and he said something I, I honestly don't remember because you know I have short term memory Big and then he said something and I was like I said it was 14 soft <laughs> 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 he said something. No human can it, had to, it had to do with something with like like morals and like values and stuff. And I was like, oh, actually, that's pretty hot. And so I looked at him and I was just like randomly, I was like, can I take you out for dinner? And then on he the spot? Looked, yeah, on the spot. Like uh, mid podcast? Yeah. Oh, shit. And then he looked at me and then he was like this. You know that, you know that face <laughs> yeah, that he yeah, makes? Yeah. That face. And then, and then he just like totally ignored it. Uh-huh. And then so after. Fuck, what episode was this? I don't remember. I don't remember. This. It has been. It had it's one be. of like your first five. I'd no, say. it had it was to be after Halloween. after Halloween. It was, it was after Halloween. Okay, it was yes. during Halloween. Or Halloween after was like what, after, Halloween was right why. after Vegas, right? Here's why it had to be after Halloween. It was after Halloween. She was dating other people. Remember? <laughs> oh yeah, 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 yeah. Who was yeah. I dating? Oh yeah. Who was I dating? You were being a bad girl. Who was I? Da- Oh, what we were the at fuck? a Halloween party. We were at a Halloween party, and you were with somebody else. And also, I, we, we were also <laughs> Wait, just on. like running wild and free in Vegas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, that was crazy, you guys. Crazy thing. Okay, Who I'm were you gonna, with? Huh? During Halloween. Halloween. Who was I? Oh. You know? Just you know. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you all know who this no, person is, too. No, but I wasn't dating this person. You weren't dating, but you were... I haven't even done anything with this all right, person. So continue, continue okay. on with the story. Anyways, um, so you hear him talk about morals and values, and you're like, oh, my God, a guy with morals and yeah, values. Yeah, so I, I took my shot. <laughs> well, like mid-podcast, you were being serious. Yeah, I was being serious. When did you actually shoot a real shot? Because like, if okay. you, I don't think he thought you were serious. After the podcast. That I same podcast. That same podcast. Uh-huh. I was like, this motherfucker didn't hear me right. So I basically said, hey, Jeremy, can I take some boxes of nectar? And then he was like, sure. And I said, oh, it's heavy. Can you take me? Can you help me take it to my car? And so I didn't he- know her strength at the time. <laughs> <laughs> now I know that was a bold faced lie. She could have carried hey. six boxes herself <laughs> with one arm. Extreme Riz, low key. Keep and going. So, and so he, he walked, over, you know, he walked me to my car and then I opened the, you know, the trunk and then he put it in and I said, hey, for real though, can I take you out to dinner? And he said, oh, uh, uh, <laughs> you were serious about that? And I was like, yeah, I'm serious. Like, when are you, when are you free? And he was like, oh, I'm free in 
three weeks? I was like, wait, wait, wait. three weeks? Why do, why do I sound like a, I'm like a crow magnet? That's exactly no, what you sound literally, like. Literally, you were, you, were, you were acting a little weird. You were acting funny. Yeah, you're a little yeah. goofy guy. Yeah. A little goofy silly you guy. You nervous. You just... Hey, but hey, ladies out there, Riz, she was like, I need to get this guy alone. Hit her, hit him with the damsel in distress, d- distress act, knowing damn well she's stronger than him. <laughs> <laughs> and then got him to, and she didn't break a sweat. She had the man carry her shit out to the car and bagged him in her trunk. Like, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, okay. So he was like, yeah, I'm free in three weeks. And I was like, Busy three man. weeks? Yeah. And then, he, and then, so that night, he didn't tell me exactly what day. He was like, I'll let you know. So that night, uh, I hit him up and I said, so do you know the day? And then that's when we started talking. We started talking and, and, and then ever since then, like he started messaging me. He FaceTimed me, which, you know what? I don't FaceTime people. Ever. Did you ever. like FaceTiming Jeremy? I do. Uh, no, I literally, <laughs> when he FaceTimed me, I was like, what the fuck does this guy want? I'm a was Gen that weird? Um, Huh? You're a what? I'm Gen Z. So like. What year were you born? Yeah. What year were you born? 2000. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Anyways. Gen Z loves FaceTiming too, though. Yeah, yeah but I'm I a different FaceTiming. Gen Z. Yeah, you're Anyways, an old I didn't one. like it. <laughs> you're lying. I didn't, okay, I didn't like FaceTime, but he kept FaceTiming me. And uh, the thing is, I didn't even have internet in my house, you know, because I used to live under a rock. Yeah. So it would be like, I. I oh, oh, <laughs> like, oh, I remember like, you didn't even have a computer or she, internet. She'd teleport across the room. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, we, used, we talked every day. So Not every day. Yeah, we talked every day. FaceTimed every day? No, we talked oh, every day. Uh, I literally just said we talked every day. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy, are you okay? Happy wife, happy life. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. So. <laughs> okay, continue. Okay. Um, yeah, and then we, we talked every day and uh-huh. he was like, okay, I can't wait three weeks to, uh, to have this date. Uh-huh. So let's go like the following week. Oh. Right? Not the following week, it was like two weeks. So you, no, so it you wasn't folded. two weeks. Yeah. So my question I had here It was one was, week, after one week. My question here was, Jeremy, did you fold instantly? And I feel that that was true. So after we started talking and I got, so on the podcast, she's very funny mm-hmm. and there's parts about her, like she was still very new too. So yeah, I didn't yeah. really fully get a sense of who she was, but not going to lie. She is attractive, physically attractive. You guys all thought so too. Um, okay. What the fuck? <laughs> I would just say that. I don't know. It's just like uh, you can look at her. You can look at her and you can okay, see that she's agree, physically but attractive. Like, <laughs> it's just okay. a weird thing to bring up. All right. Anyways. <laughs> anyways, keeping it professional, right? Keeping I it professional. keeping it my keeping hey, it professional. Hey, you're out of the doghouse, man. You're hey, out keeping of the it professional. House. I turned her into a, she was just a blob to me. A t- a blob. Yeah, like a talking blob. And then when she asked me on the date and we started talking during that week, I got to know her beyond just what she shared on the podcast. And uh-huh. there was a lot of layers to her. Uh-huh. And I was like, okay. She's like my an assumption, onion. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Like a stinky onion. You guys, yeah. this is from Shrek. Get hey, but I will, from Shrek. But I will say, like, my first assumption, I saw her social media. She was funny, but the content that she'd post, I'm like, she's another influencer. Just say LA. it. Just, just say it. It's an instant no, thought. No, I just thought that no. she was just another LA say, influencer. Say it. Say what? I don't know what to say. She knows what you were going to say. What? I already said it. An, an instant thought. No, I did not think that. Did not think that. I just thought she was very LA, part of the scene. But uh-huh. when I got to know her, I saw how caring she was, how much uh-huh. she took care of her family. And so I was like, oh, like this girl's very cool. So then I was like, okay, I want to go on this date. Mm. I want to get to know her. <laughs> Can I say something? Yes. So you know how we went on a first trip to Vegas? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be- yeah, yeah. Like right when, like I wasn't even a part of the podcast yeah. at this point. You were just a guest. Yeah, yep. I was a guest. So, <laughs> yeah, okay, I shared a room with Maru. I think, I think, I don't know if Maru was there, but I think. Everyone oh, was, okay. when I came to the room. To the room, Maru, yeah, everyone it was, was me, there? It was like me and somebody else because we were just sitting yeah. around. You guys were the only ones up. But I never talked to Jeremy like one-on-one mm-hmm. at that point. So he didn't know me very well. I didn't know him, but he was being hella awkward. He was just like, oh, uh, okay. So Esther, um, what do you do? I was, it was joking. Like- I was like joking because <laughs> it was me, somebody else, and then Maru and her. And they were just like. Sitting around doing nothing. So as a joke, I was like asking like really like awkward. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. And then I was like, why is this guy talking to me? 
<laughs> this was before I even had interest. I thought we right? were friends at that point. <laughs> no, I, I didn't. I didn't consider him a friend. Yeah, I just you didn't consider any of us friends, yeah. which is weird. But anyways, yeah, no, why did you come on the trip then? <laughs> no, I consider like Vegas. I love gambling. I'll go. Oh yeah, like that's <laughs> that's what I was there for. But no, I I consider Wu Talk a friend. Like I was like, oh, at that point, Wu Talk, I know him, and like we've already hung out. Who about me? You know. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't even like her back then. <laughs> I did, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I looking forgot you were on that trip. Yeah, okay, all right. <laughs> Relax, brother. Um, yeah, but but basically, I was like, damn. You know, that's what I thought of him. Like, just the guy that I was like, oh, maybe, like, we'll... we'll work together you know that type of vibe yeah so that i thought that was funny like how it went from that to like me fully hitting him hitting on him you know mm -hmm. and then on top of that that vegas trip <laughs> he was making out with the girl <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> and and you know what's my so king. funny back then I, w I thought it was hilarious so i was recording it on my phone <laughs> i was I, I still have that on my phone wait, and wait, i'm wait. just like damn wait. like Does he's that piss you off no i look at that and i and i like crinkle paper like i crinkle <laughs> like cans sometimes and i said why do you still have it can you send that to me <laughs> that's yeah. sure. that's like, it cracks me up because i remember thinking like you got no bitches before that shit <laughs> He did. You I was already like, were correct. <laughs> like this man, I've never seen this man talk to a woman in my life, bro. I, and I remember. I look up and you're making out with random shorty. I'm like, I'm very yo, private about that. Yo, Wutak I remember. Knows, but Wutak's the only one that knows. Yeah, I'm the only what? one that knows. About, he, about he, he, Jeremy is a little, Jeremy. Jeremy. Jer, Jer, what? Jeremy, what gets bitches? No, no. Jeremy gets no bitches. <laughs> None. <laughs> no, oh, you guys God. were gonna go somewhere with this, huh? No, but anyways, you thought I had no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll get back to it later at home. <laughs> okay, anyways. What were you saying? Um, yeah, I remember I remember he was making out with the girl and I was like, Vit. I was like, look, yeah. I was, we were cracking up, like pointing and cracking up. <laughs> and I was like and I was like zooming in and stuff. And now when I see that video, I'm just like <laughs> I scream into the pillow. Was like, Your fit was definitely hilarious that day too. I don't remember oh, what it was. Leopard shorts and the oh. dragon shirt. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> something, something funny, man. I, I have was pictures it? from that night. Yeah. Anyways, uh, so what? Like, I want to. Wait, okay. we have an Instagram photo of us holding the sign. Yeah, remember, yeah, they yeah, made yeah. a sign that up. was that night. Mm -hmm. And you were wearing cargo pants that you couldn't get off your fucking pants. <laughs> yeah. You were yeah. so drunk, you couldn't get your pants off. Yeah. yeah. Passed out next to the bed on the ground. Yeah. I remember. I remember thinking he's a that fucking wasn't geek. Me. God. Indeed, he is. I don't know. I did a whole like 180 right there. I mean, that's 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 part of Jeremy's charm. Yeah, he's True. just unapologetically himself. True. He doesn't care what he's wearing in public. He'll wear it. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't care how bad he looks in public. Look at, look at his shirt. <laughs> how are you feeling today? Gucci, Prada, Fendi, Chanel. <laughs> Go show the camera. <laughs> no, show your camera. Yeah. That's fine. You're, it'll see it. Have you ever had seltzers? Wait, is this like the regular one? Oh. These ones. Ah. Let's try this one. Okay. This was only 90 calories. No ice. Mm. How do you like that? Much better. Pog. There you go. Do you have just the lychee one in a box? Ooh, not at the moment. We have the 12 pack. Yeah. What? Oh. Is that what oh. I see? Yeah. This is our baby. I just like it because it's light, you know. Oh, yeah, that is so nice. Refreshing. Refreshing, yes, yes. Yeah, this new one and the lychee one. Mm -hmm. right yeah, I'll try one. Oh, Thank perfect. You. Thank you so much. Thank you for trying. Thank you. I want you to describe your first date. Let's start with Jeremy. You're, are you picking her up? Are you being a gentleman? Or she straight up rizzed you? Wait, wait, hold on. What was the first date? The Thai restaurant. Oh, oh, yeah. What was yeah. it? What restaurant? Yeah, yeah, it was like, I forgot what it was I called. I forgot the name of the place, but my friend had recommended it to me, so I went cold, which was not the best move. Like, but cold like, as in you don't know the restaurant? I didn't know at the all. restaurant, but mm. he swore by it, and then Who's now. Who's the friend? But just a buddy, I'm not gonna. Oh, you don't know who? You, you Do guys I, wouldn't know, oh, who, I don't he know is. who okay. But he just recently was like, oh, like, this spot was good. I really enjoyed it. So we went, and the food was good. No, the food was not good. Food was mid. Food but was mid? The conversation mid? was good. Yeah, I was eating like, what the fuck? Why'd you take me here? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. No, no, no. no I was, it, was a, it was a nice, vibey restaurant, though. I like, I really enjoyed my conversation with him. Mm. And, but the food was like, I wouldn't go back. All right, real quick, yeah. though. I want to know what the conversation... Let's just say conversation was good. Were you nervous? You're a pretty good talker, no, though. Yeah, you're, I'm you're a, a yapper. Talker. And she's a yapper, too. Yeah, she's... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so... The, and I, I, by this point... Be yapping. By this point, here's why FaceTiming is the move. <laughs> it's a mini date. Bro, you are on a podcast with this I know. woman. That, see, <laughs> what do you mean a mini date? No, 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 no. Listen, listen. B 
because again, the podcast was very surface level. She would come on the podcast and immediately dip to work. She never came and hang, hung out with us or partied with us. Uh-huh. So I didn't really know anything Party about her. Not like often, often, but yeah. I mean, I ne- would never party either. So there. We went to Vegas trip yeah. together, man. This guy said she would never party with us. She was there she more was than you were. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> never mind. I would never be at the parties. Yeah. But r- regardless, like FaceTiming is great because it already breaks the comfortability. Mm-hmm. Comfort. Comfortability. Barrier. Yeah. Yeah. So at that point, we had kind of already kind of like the podcast plus that mm-hmm. plus hanging out at like Vegas things like that. It wasn't awkward at all or anything like that. And then the conversations is like I got to know her, like her past, uh. like what she did, what she cared about, ah. her morals. Mm. She talked about like. So you learned that she was just, she was a thug. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I got very scared. <laughs> that day you talked about your motorcycle accident, and no, then no, no, I it wasn't a about- motorcycle accident. Don't make it sound cool. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. A what is a motor? Accident, right? It was like a fucking bicycle, electric bike, <laughs> electric bike, <laughs> <laughs> <Not even> a <laughs> scooter. <laughs> I was trying to make you look good. Yeah, and no, just no, killed. I can't allow that on my watch. The truth <laughs> must be said. We've lied to them enough already. This man yes. is a horrible person. Okay, well, so I'm an investigative journalist. <laughs> I'm sorry. So that's what that's what we talked about. I talked. To, I think I opened up to my accident as well. My mm-hmm. my kickboxing accident accident where I developed mm-hmm. epilepsy. Mm-hmm. Uh, but I think he already knew. You already knew this. No. No, no, you didn't talk didn't. about that. You didn't, and you also didn't want me to tell anybody else for a very long yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. She was like yeah. very like shy about certain things. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's yeah. that's when I noticed that she was actually a very shy person, and all of her behavior was just an outer shell to cover the shyness. Not yes. shy, not shy, but not, like not shy. I was private. very private. Yeah. No, yeah, I'm, yeah, not, yeah, I'm very, very private. Very open up. private. Yeah, I'm not a shy person, just very private only because I don't like to show that I'm vulnerable. Mm-hmm. So like when, but but I was easily able to open up to him and that's when I was like, oh yeah, like I, I really fuck with him, you know? Yep. Because other people like, it takes like a long time for me to open up or I never do. Mm. Yeah. Ah, so you knew right away that he was the one for you. I mean, I, now I don't know, but back then, yeah. All right, wait, hold on. Let's, okay, then, what, what did he do to piss you off today? I'm kidding. What did he do though? Yeah, what are you guys fighting about? Because you could call them out too. What we do? Oh my God! Okay, no, I don't want to. I don't want to say it okay, okay. on this. This would this would be bad. Why would the club be bad? thing? Huh? The club yeah, thing? yeah. You're still pissed about that? Yeah. The club thing? Th- that's, oh no! Wait, wait, don't say still. Wait, wait, but that's like, that's a question for later. <laughs> I will bring is. that up oh. myself. So and as the interviewer, <laughs> and you agreed to be on this, you signed waivers. You have to answer. We didn't. We didn't so, anyways, okay. I signed the waiver for us. <laughs> <laughs> I said okay. three. Okay. Right, anyways, Extra one. Anyways, if you guys uh, want to know what he did, sign up for our fourth wall. Oh. I'll spill everything. Nice, nice. Is We're getting out the hood, baby. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting out. Wait, isn't this already? No, this be is out. A regular no, this, episode. Is, this okay. is a regular episode. Oh, okay. Anyways, um, Esther, did you feel like Jeremy had any riz on that first date? Oh, he has absolutely none. <laughs> The, se- the the after dinner, uh-huh. <laughs> can I say everything? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, mean, yeah, oh, yeah. I know. Actually, we signed waivers. So yeah, yeah, you signed waivers. Okay. Um, <laughs> we went to a cocktail bar uh-huh. and we were ah, drinking. The blueprint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the blueprint. blueprint. It was a, it I'm was already a- disgusted that you have talked to him before. Okay. <laughs> and got all this stuff. No, I didn't, all these I, didn't I didn't follow his blueprint. Okay. We went to dinner. That's a no-no on the first oh, yeah, one. Yeah, no, the, he already broke the blueprint. Yeah, I broke okay. the blueprint. But you could break the blueprint for the right I girl. Would say, I told him that too. I said, <laughs> I said, bro, you know, some women are not blueprint women. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so I would like to say that on first dates, I hate being touchy. Uh-huh. And I don't like when people try to make the first move. Mm. But after like a couple cocktails, he was like, can I kiss you? And I said, God. <laughs> God, but then I was like, "All right, that is not true. It's true. I literally was like, I literally told you, I was like, I don't like, I don't like physical touch. (laughs) She was touching me first. (laughs) When? When we went to pay? Was that the name? And and was I was I rubbing your legs? No, I wasn't. No, he said, "Yeah, (laughs) no, I was not. No, I like to keep things very, very like, you know, wholesome. Uh Yeah, wholesome. Well, like, okay, so you didn't touch him at all." Uh, no, I didn't. But when he asked mm-hmm. for the kiss, in my head, I was like, damn, I want. I didn't want to do this. Mm-hmm. But I was like, all right, fine. So, so you I did kiss him, him first yes, day. first day oh. I did. And that's like something I usually like never do. But I was like, but I, but I did feel like I knew Jeremy because uh-huh. I did know yeah, him. You, you guys, that's not your yeah. first date, like first time meeting each other. So it was, you guys, a, little, yeah. so it was a little different, yeah. All right, so rate, his, rate first kiss. 
No, it was it was good. Like was sparks good. flying, like sparks. <laughs> I got lost in the story. I, I, I heard I heard the Lion King theme song playing. Ah, Sabena, like a sun rising. Hey, I mean, you know how Esther says she doesn't like when the guy makes the first move. I'm imagining her grabbing you, picking you up on the wall. And it's, like, it's close to it. I was yeah. I was you know so that <laughs> meme where it's like the girl the girl has the guy up against yeah, yeah, the fence. Yeah, yeah. It was like that. I want that so bad. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it was, was good. legit, y'all two vibes for real. <laughs> hey, no, no, no. Let's stop that joke. Let's cut that shit. Everybody acted like it's not she's a joke. Like, the fuck? No, she. This is that she no, be the not. man in the relationship. She's not the man. She's clearly the woman, but she be she. she it's not true. Yeah, she got you on it's a tight leash. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Not yeah. True. Every time, so for the audience, every time me and Vit would talk to Jeremy, and then he'd, he'd be stressed out. We're like, "Well, what's wrong? You want to come out tonight?" He's like, oh, "I can't, guys." I'm on thin ice. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? I'm like, I'm like, how you been on thin ice for five months? <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, I never tell him he There's can't no go thick out ice at all. Of course, no one's ever like, you can't go out. No, you can't, I, no, you can't use no. tests. You know damn well what you what girls do. You're not you're not gonna say literally verbally you can't go out, but you will be mad if he decided to go out that night. Yes, you would have hey, been. This is this is something I learned from Wu Talk. It's called gaslighting. Um, I would like to say I don't even know what that word means. <laughs> Anyways, no, I mean, I wouldn't, I, yeah, I mean, why would, uh -huh. why did, why is he on thin ice? I don't why, know. He should have, he should have never been there. <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> I learned like, that from Wu Talk. <laughs> <laughs> I am an, I am an adventurer. I like to take risks. So sometimes you I do, find myself on thin ice. All right. Well, uh, we all know you, everyone knew, everyone here knew you had no riz. So that question was <laughs> self-explanatory, but how was Esther's riz? On that first date. Wait, did she riz you at all? Because she's probably, constantly rizzing you on camera. I probably couldn't tell. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? She did pull out my chair. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I hey, can't you gotta let the joke run a little bit longer, man. That would have been funny as hell had you finished the sentence. I can't tell. I can't tell if a woman has riz versus like I was just like very comfortable. Mm. No. Let's just say that I did the payment dance. Ah. Oh. Because because I asked him out, I asked him out on this dinner. So oh, I was, and then you paid. I was gonna. Was good. I was. Should. I also asked him if he if I want if he wanted me to pick him up, but he said <laughs> no. Like, Do you what? remember? No, <laughs> I, but no. But he he said no. But I'm the man, so I'll pick you up and I'll pay. And I was like, nah, dude. I asked you out, and <laughs> hey, we were hey, hey, you we forgot. Were this, well, I didn't pick you up. <laughs> you drove to my house, and then we went from my house. Oh, that to is the, true. Uh, yeah, that's true. Because yeah. back then you lived fucking far. far. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, they've been lying to you. Like oh, y'all yeah. don't even know how bad they've been lying to you. You don't know how deep the web goes. Yo, they live together. They've been living they've together. They've been living. We just together. got a house. Yes, bought the first house. No, we're renting. We're we renting. Did, we didn't rent the first they, house together. Yeah, but like, they have a kid. <laughs> <laughs> His name's Vit. I'm in. Oh, oh. <laughs> but he lives in the basement because because he, <laughs> he cries too loud. Wait, fuck. What was I gonna say about y'all living together? <laughs> yeah, we live together. Is that not is that not fucking crazy? How long recent. were you guys dating before you moved in together? Uh, I w we barely moved in together. Uh, not barely, August. Mm. August. Hey, that like the video months. they shot of um Esther the best friend quiz on Esther's oh, YouTube yeah. channel. Ah. That's in their house. They're in pajamas. Hey, hey, gotcha, you stupid idiots. <laughs> yeah. But it was in my office, so nobody could tell because he's never in there. If yeah. anybody says that I'm not a good actor, then this is proof right here. Hey, I want to comment down below if you guys knew that they were in a secret relationship. Everyone's going to, everyone, no. nobody's going to want to. I'm going to miss that. All right, anyways, continue, man. Chocolate. Ew. Ew. That could have been poop. That's Toblerone. Hey, just continue, man. Yeah, so, so, wait, what was the question? I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> oh. I'm, sorry I'm sorry, Mr. Interview. Don't yell at me, sir. Um, I'm pretty sure I just asked the audience to, to, oh, to tell oh. us if they knew you were Yeah, dating. yeah, yeah. And everyone that kind of knew is going to bullshit. Nobody wants to look like a dummy. We just put the ultimate, you know, you, we just you hoodwinked them. Hoodwink, that's the word. Yes. Hoodwinked them. Uh, man, I'm I've been waiting all my life to use that word. I'm sure there's people that were like, oh, they got to be and had a good hunch, but I... There's no way anybody fully knows. I want to know, also comment down below, because Jeremy and Esther in public are very touchy. So, like, he, they would <laughs> run into you guys in public. I'd shove her into a bush. <laughs> I'd be like, it'll get away. No, no, people have. 
seen us exactly, out and about. Exactly, right? And they yeah. confirmed it in real life. So if, you, if you're watching this episode, comment down below. <laughs> no, you yeah. know what I do? Uh. If, if they would see us in real life, after they're like, oh, photo. And when they walk away, I say, if you tell, I'll fucking kill you. He does. That's crazy. But right in their life. And then he's like, kidding. just kidding. Have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so you couldn't tell if Esther was risen you up either. How uh, about a year in now? Like, are y'all still, do y'all still uh, flirt with each other? Or is it like Let me just grandma, say this. grandpa shit? Let me just say this. First of all, this is my first, another big part about our relationship is this, this is the first relationship I've ever had in my life. Damn, at, real, at 30 plus. Yes. <laughs> damn. damn. Yeah, because the first, like, I'm, we're boyfriend and girlfriend exclusive. That's the first one. And you moved in after a year. That's yeah, no, less no, than we, a year. We moved, Not less than a year. Well, first of all, we started dating and- Two months later, we made a month and a half after we started, we made it official. Mm -hmm. So I moved quick. <laughs> I moved very fast. And all I want to say is when people say, I never understood this, the, the term, relationships are hard. Uh -huh. I, I still don't understand it because it's so easy. And I'm still in the honeymoon phase. Come here, sweetie. Oh, that's probably the first kiss that they've seen on this channel. That's crazy. Yeah, relationships are easy, guys. Get in them. No, uh, <laughs> hey, for real, though, when people said relationships are hard, I was like, how hard could it be? They're hard. Why'd you get up and just... I wanted a Toblerone. Oh. I saw the little <laughs> edge of it. Here you go. Uh, but yeah, no, there are things that Jared, because it is his first relationship, not to mention that he doesn't really... I mean, like, his parents are not here. He's been alone for, like, the longest time. Like, as in, like, he's very <laughs> independent, right? You shoved that whole king size Toblerone in your mouth? I couldn't hold it. We're gonna melt with my ham. Anyways. Yeah, like I can see what you saw in him. He's very he's very <laughs> independent. <laughs> here, here, here. Hey, yo, 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 here, here. This is like, this is like watching a child get interviewed with his mom. <laughs> oh fuck. Chew slowly. Don't 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 talk. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, so gross. Hey, we gotta cut this part out, man. <laughs> um, but yeah, no. Um, because he's very independent, he's never had a girlfriend. Like there are things that he he does. It's not called being independent. <laughs> okay, but you okay, lonely. Um, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, yeah, though. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Like he's always doing things on his own. Like he's. I'm also ultra busy. Nobody truly understands how busy I am. And I warned her. I understand. It's true. It's yeah. true. No, but then he he lacks some sort of like consideration. Like, I'm not saying that he is considerate, but, like, he sometimes forgets that there's another person in his life now. But there could be a balance. Maybe Ooh. sometimes she could be a little too high maintenance, and sometimes daddy needs to work. Oh. <laughs> so that's okay. where there okay. was a lot of clashing. Come on. I, th okay. I do feel like there was a lot of clashing. There was okay. a lot of clashing. Let's play a game. There was. Is it? The keyword was. Was it being inconsiderate, or was I being too needy? Okay, okay, let's, okay. Play let's play this, play this game. game. Oh. The first scenario. Very dangerous game. Very yeah, dangerous. Very dangerous. Hey, There's we're going to all remain unbiased here. Unbiased. Ian must remain unbiased. Unbiased, okay. Unbiased, okay. 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 Also, wait, wait. Let's play this game with the audience. No, and you keep eating that Toblerone, okay? Let's ask the audience, too. Audience, you say down below. You'll get your chance to speak after she says. But you have to keep your mouth shut, okay? You While can she say talks, it after. Yeah, shut up. Okay. All right. Okay, so first thing is, okay, so we're 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 hanging out mm -hmm. in a, a hotel room, right? And what I'm are you guys like, doing there? <laughs> in Hawaii, in Hawaii. Oh, okay. Okay, so I'm just like, Jeremy, I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. He was like, oh, okay, well, I'm sorry. I can't eat with you because I have to do some work. Like, go you know, out and do some work. So gang calls, and gang's over here like, yo, Jeremy, I'm at the store. Do you want me to, like pick you up some food and he was like no I'm good <laughs> and I literally Wait. look at him and I was like and I, I literally look at him and I was like why didn't you ask me if I wanted anything he was like oh what did, what did you say I was like, my bad wasn't thinking <laughs> I had my mind on other things busy working okay okay managing okay. like 70 people on a trip okay the but work trips are the work that's where some of our biggest fights were Work it, trips. It's true. Yeah, it is annoying. It is very annoying. I, I, I get, I get, I get it. I get it. But the thing is, I'm like by myself, and I'm just like, damn, like, yeah. I'm hungry. And like, if he could be like, oh shit, my my girl's hungry. Hey yo, can you pick me up this? Even if I'm not hungry, it's like, mm -hmm. hey yo, can you pick up this stuff? And then like, you know, that's it. It would've been so like, thank right. you, you know. Well, to the, do you have rebuttal? I'm saying probably just slipped my mind because I was busy. Okay. Very different on a work trip versus like. But he does that quite often. Home? No, no, no. At home and things, I always ask you. All right, well, it's I up to the jury well. to decide, inconsiderate or needy. Ian, 
One or the Ian, other. Just know. No, nah, I'm just kidding. Uh, Ian, man, you got. We gave you a mic, and this is how you gonna treat it. Um, I think that there needs to be more empathy on both sides. Yeah. Whack. Anyways, <laughs> inconsiderate. <laughs> <laughs> what, is, what is your vote? I agree with Ian, but also for the simple fact of like, because I'm I'm picturing myself in that in that thing. My my mind wouldn't since it's not my money, it's my boy's money. I wouldn't think about anybody else other than me. No, no, no. You you definitely should have said pick up food for Esther. But I don't even I get remember his, this situation. I get his point of view too, because I get like that where I'm literally slammed so busy, and then it's like the argument. So I, I'm I'm on your side here yeah. because I if I was just your boy and you did that to me I'd be like what the fuck we, we'll talk is literally the boy version of me yeah. so I under, all I would understand. do in that situation yeah. instead of anger would go hey gang never mind someone someone actually wants food yeah 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 it's, did it's you do a, that it's a solved I don't even remember oh. I, I think at that point she's like no I don't want it I think it was more anger and upset that I didn't did think you about get it. angry right after because that, that is a lot of her reaction it's like oh you're being inconsiderate but it's like. Mm -hmm. I'm just be busy, be slipping my mind. Yeah. Just a gentle reminder. Uh -huh. Doesn't have to become a thing of like I don't care about you. Like that's where it goes mm -hmm. sometimes. And I I'm think it when like, it adds up, when it's like when I do feel like <laughs> when I do feel like he's being like a little yeah. like impatient or like you know just not considerate. It just adds up like little things, little things, and I'm mm -hmm. just like you know what, whatever. Like you don't care. But the thing is, that's not the case. He does care. Exactly. But but I do. But I do like. Yeah, I, I could I could have more empathy for sure, hundred yeah. percent. Yeah. Especially if he was willing to resolve it right away, he may fuck up. But you're dating basically a toddler. He's a hundred percent. Hundred percent. I also think that it's because this is this is not on him, uh -huh. but I think that is because I'm always too considerate of people that uh -huh. I expect that sometimes. Yeah. That's not that's not his fault. It's. What? <laughs> you finish your thought because I'm gonna add on top of it. And the funny thing is that you, can, can I? Now I forgot my train of thought because you were touching me oh, with man, such a so sensual, sensual hand. Okay, what was I saying? You're saying? I don't oh yeah, so because, because, because I'm so considerate that sometimes I, when someone's not like that, yeah. it kind of like makes me sad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I will say personally that that is outside of just me that has affected your view on other people. Like, Friends and people. There's yeah. a lot of times you've come to me and you're, you're upset. You feel like people don't care about you because of how much you do for them. It's true. They're bitches. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, low-key, that sounds exactly like what fucking I went through on quitting this podcast. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I totally get you. But there is that. George said something to me that, that fucking, I feel like I've said this, but are you turning down the heat? Uh, cold. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Turn, oh. turn that shit on. I'm sweating balls over here. No, same, same. Um, But yeah, it was like, um, it's, it's expectations are what causes you that sadness. Yeah. And it's because you're... If you're a giving kind person, like expecting other people to be like that is only going to make you miserable. A hundred percent. Yeah. And I also think that it sucks because when people are like, you know, you do too much, maybe you should tone it down. You know, sometimes they say that yeah. because some people are not going to um, reciprocate, re re reciprocate or whatever. Yeah. Right. But I'm just like, damn, but this is the person I am. And if I can't give my like true like self self, then I just it's hard for me to like tone it down. No, it's not about toning it down. It's just don't expect it back. Like I know that's that's a problem. Yeah, yeah. that's a problem for me that I have that I will. And it's work seeing on. that. Oh, what are you gonna say? Uh, someone told me a while ago. They said, "Give to give, not to receive." Mm. Yeah, mm. but I think that there there's mm. a point. Hundred percent. There's a point where it's just like you're not you're not. No, getting, there's a balance, of course. Yeah, there's with, a boundary. With, yes. Yeah, exactly. There's there's like a certain limit where it's just like, okay, that's enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know I mean, yeah. But I feel like, yeah, I do kind of expect too much from yeah. some people. I also, so that's me personally, in my relationship with Jeremy, I don't feel that way about Jeremy at all. I feel like maybe Jeremy is hard headed, but he's not like a not giving, not care. He's he's one of the more giving, caring people that I know. Where even when I feel like, damn, I'm just doing all this bullshit, but I'm like, yeah, Jeremy though, Jeremy needs it. You know what I mean? Like, I, yeah. I'd be feeling like Jeremy deserve it. Oh man, I could yeah. slurp you right now. <laughs> if this doesn't work out, <laughs> hey, I was there first. I'm just saying. Yeah. I recognize the greatness first. Just no, know that. I know that he's a good guy. Like that's the thing. That's why I'm when nice I do guy. get upset at him, oh my god, where's his fedora? Um, hey, how do you really feel about Jeremy's uh, fashion sense? I mean, be honest. Okay. You signed the waiver. I mean, I literally sometimes do his laundry and I'm like, oh, it's missing. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, which piece and of there, there are times there are times when I'd be like, if if you know, like if I give you a hundred dollars, uh -huh. you gotta toss this away. <laughs> or like or like if I if I win this bet, you have to toss it away. 
Or no, no I don't even tell him that. I, I said, no, I said, her. no, I say, if if I win this, you have to do something for me. He's like, okay. He takes it. I'm like, you gotta throw that shit. Away. <laughs> Wait, what pieces of clothing have Remember you made him get rid of? Shirt? Striped shirt. <laughs> Uh, there's been some like maybe like pants. You can throw away the shirts. fucking green leopard the, shirt. No. The green leopard. No. Oh my stop, god, stop, that one stop. is Moving horrible. On. Moving on. All right, yo. Also, okay. So when when they first started like legit dating, and we would like go to functions like as a group, Jeremy would show up like actually presentable. And I'd be like, yo, where did my man get drip? And then Esther pops up like I dressed him. <laughs> <laughs> Even his jewelry too. These pants. Yeah, finally some normal pants. That's her bottom. I've got Jeremy's like purple and green plaid pants in my trunk and I just have never given it to him for your sake. No, 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 no. I actually want those ones back. <laughs> no, I got no, 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 lost I them, dude. Bro, I swear someone broke in my car and took only your pants. That's Let's crazy. go to your car right now. Hey, I'll those walk pants were so fire that someone must have taken them. Dude, they saw it and they're like, this guy's got style. Damn. Actually, for real, I want those pants. I'm, I'm pretty sure when you told me they were dating, I was like... No wonder he's been dressing better. <laughs> you said that. You I know, said that. It was right after uh, the Song Life dinner. Hey, hey, hey. We were walking out. <laughs> he didn't know all the way up till then? Yeah, he didn't, he didn't know me. for... Yeah. What? So I was just holding a secret? Yeah. Wow. You did hold a secret, yeah. I'm a good at that. Vid actually didn't hold secrets. <laughs> he told everybody on some. No, I didn't tell them. <laughs> yes, you did. I didn't <laughs> tell them. <laughs> no, no, he didn't tell them. It was more so like... Oh, Esther's dating someone, and they, they started they listing know that you were everybody. Someone. Okay, listen. So, so basically, they okay. They knew because they were like, "Oh, Esther." I think they were like, "Oh, let's go find some guys." I think Maru may, may have been like, oh. "Oh, let's go find some guys." And I was like, "Oh no, like I'm ah, dating Maru. someone." GD and she was like, "Oh, she's again. like, oh, who do we know him?" And I was like, "Oh, you know, it'll come out soon." And then I think later on. They asked, they kind of like grilled Vic. Bro, they pressed me. Yeah, they, yeah, they, they pressed <laughs> him. that weak under pressure? No, but then he- For Maru? <laughs> hey, no, but I don't know. Maru pressing him? <laughs> Come on, Vic. <laughs> I guess- Period. I don't, no. <laughs> no, but the thing is, they were listing people. They were like, they were like this. Yeah. They, were, they even, I think they said everybody but Jeremy. <laughs> and, then, and then they like narrowed it down. No, it, was on, it was on the plane ride home from New York and they were like, exactly like that. It was like, is it blah, blah, blah? I was like, no. <laughs> they even and then they were like, Eddie put on before. your mom. I'm not gonna lie. I don't care about your relationship enough to lie on my mom. It's like a hypothetical, <laughs> like they're gonna go shoot your mom. <laughs> and then he starts crying. I gotta, no, not my mom. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta stand for something, man. So when when Jeremy's name came up, Vit just went like this. <laughs> <laughs> but also, bro, that's why you're like, come on, man. If they're listing people's names, you can't answer no to any of them because the second you don't answer, you're gonna look like you're lying. Like you just shut up about and the you whole know, thing. Yeah, and that's that's when they're like, "Oh, Jeremy, dude, I and panicked." Then, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, also, Vin was like, "Damn, Jeremy, is that a Chrome Hearts ring?" And then and then he was like, "Yeah." I was like, "Oh, okay." Yeah, yeah, and he was like, "You would never buy that for yourself." Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but yeah. That shit dead ass puzzled me. Of like. What is going on? <laughs> okay. But yeah, to answer the fashion so question. <laughs> no, that ass. For answering the fashion question, I think it's cute that he has an o his own style. I think that's very cute. Is that cute. what he's we call it nowadays? His own style? It's my own style. <laughs> I'm whimsical and free. Mm. He's whimsical. Very, whimsical. Yeah, he's, he is. He is. Quirky. But there there are some pieces that I'm just like, that needs to burn yep. in hell. I totally agree. But, but yeah, other than that, like the shirt, I think it's cute. Yeah, that, that one's funny. That one a lot gave of me a giggle. compliments on this one. Yeah, yeah. This oh. is my old friend. He ghosts me. He doesn't answer my text anymore. Mega Yacht. Oh, so you can't you can't uh, get uh So if you go to Mega Yacht and you buy a shirt and you comment, say Jeremy sent you. So maybe he talks to me again. <laughs> All right. That's so sad. So now I know. <laughs> he just stopped answering my text one day. Wait, like, can I pee pee real yeah. quick? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's take a pause. I wanna there. I wanna borrow your your cat dolph shirt, wear it out to the club one time. I don't trust you with things though. What I'll you, let what you What am I gonna do? Lose it? Stain it. You lost your. You stay in my sweater. You lost your cutie's hat. No, I didn't. You. It's oh, in my you, car. Yeah, he left. He left. He, you uh, left to here the first time. Uh, yeah. I knew. I knew. You where lost it was. your Ray Ban sunglass case. Oh, no, I yeah. found it. You lost your grills. Yeah, he did, he did five. Yeah, honestly, you lose so many you high things, value you find items. Them, you lose things. You find them. It makes me kind of concerned. And like, like sometimes you don't find very, them. It's a very special shirt to me. Cat okay. Delph? Yeah. Hold on, I gotta go to the bathroom. Yeah, we'll take a pause here. All right, ready? <clears throat> oh, boy. When was the first time you guys fucked? <laughs> <laughs> Had sex. We are still waiting till marriage. It's to true. this day. No, 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 no. Okay, no, no. come on. You don't want to answer for real? Wait, what? Okay, maybe more like after the first date, how long did y'all wait? Is that a better question? Okay, whisper into my ear, because I forgot. 
No, it's not. It's not. No, you dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, no. Yeah. No. Hey, we would like hey, to hey, 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 speak into the mic too, but okay. what? What? Okay. Just no, tell us. Okay. Jeremy, tell us your I rem- recollection. No, I remember. Okay. I remember. You say it, Jeremy. You correct her if it's wrong. Okay. Okay. Why do you guys look like you're lying? You're planning okay, a lie. I, I feel like it's too. It. I feel like it's too vulgar. Why? Yeah. Why? Say that shit. Wait, if, say if you don't want to. Sec- okay, don't fine, fine. Second day, I saw it. Third day, yes. <laughs> I saw what it. Do you mean I saw it. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what does that mean? What does that mean? <laughs> I'm imagining Jeremy just be like, uh? Oh? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's in a box. <laughs> Present it. Man, hey, look, 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 look. This was this was my face. Oh, okay. He's like, just warming you up to the idea. Huh? <laughs> you ever see the, the fucking Omega calls of Kermit the Frog? And he's like, hey. And oh, then yeah. a cucumber just pops up on the screen. <laughs> They're like, no. Uh, I feel that. like I ruined everyone's Wait, but life. <laughs> what do you mean you saw it? Yeah, what, you got, what the fuck does that mean? I think the second date was at his house. He mm. made me pasta. Oh, you cooked and for her second stuff. day. What yeah, a he whore. Did. He's a, no, he's a, is that a whore move? Absolutely. I'm a good chef. Sec- no. That's a slutty move. No. He is a good chef, though, yeah. He is, he is. Also, Ooh. think about this. We literally known each other, and like we've been filming it this whole like, time. It wasn't like second, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah it was like your 15th time hanging out. It's yeah. not yeah, like yeah, actually yeah. second date ever. And yeah. I already felt very, very like comfortable with him because yeah. I saw him like literally I mean, you're also forced often. to talk to each other for hours, uh, multiple hours exactly, at a time every exactly. week. All I'm exactly. hearing is a lot of yapping. What do you mean you saw it? <laughs> I'm still so confused. Moving on. <laughs> Moving you're on. Not gonna, you're not going to drop the Riz on Wait, us, man? I, I what feel you like mean? I, <laughs> what you mean? Hey, what you three, do three is when, when, is pretty So good, I invited man. her over. I invited her over. Uh-huh. When and I cooked her the meal. Yeah, you know, when, when I was cooking the meal, she opened the door and I was butt naked. <laughs> <laughs> Actually? No. Oh. No. I was like, oh, that's super lame. <laughs> no. I don't want to ruin people's minds. Oh, so you don't want to say what yeah. that means. <laughs> No, Use I your tell, imagination. I could tell you guys or people on the fourth wall, but oh. come on, out in the open like that, you know right. what I mean? Should we say it, it, it and then we vulgar. bleep? It's too vulgar. Say it and then we'll cut this section yeah. for fourth. No, because I'm very, very ca- like cautious about that, uh-huh. and I was uh, like, you know what? Maybe we should wait. I was like, I want to 100% like, I don't know. Know that you're clean. Make yeah, sure no, that I'm the one. Hey, but you look at Jeremy where you're like, you're definitely clean. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, he was talking to someone else. Who are you talking to? You're talking to someone? Vegas Shorty? Huh? No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, we're back in, by the way. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. at okay. some point there, we're back and in. He was talking to someone else. So, like, so I was just like, oh, you know what? I don't, even even though I know him, I was like, I don't know if they've done it. Uh-huh. And I was just like, I'm very cautious. I'm just like, if he did, I would want him to get tested. Ooh. And then, like, just even if. Wait, even you guys don't I- use condoms? No, still. On top of it. On top of it. Yeah, yeah. like I would like mm. you. Still she's she's a uh, a clean freak. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay. So before, like, I have to dip myself in rubbing alcohol, dry <laughs> off, then I scrub myself down. I'm imagining he has just a cup of rubbing alcohol and he's like trying to aim his dick into it. <laughs> <laughs> and then I get my rubber gloves and I'm just like, hold on. <laughs> I'm like, okay, open Hazmat up. suit. <laughs> All right, this one's another raunchy one. I'm sorry, we had to have a couple. That's audience fine. requested, audience requested. No, it was just it. you two. <laughs> no, no, you no, two thank came you, up thank with you the, for the uh, thank questions, you. audience. Thank you, um, uh, Lisandro459 for the question. <laughs> Lisandro. <laughs> Esther, rate Jerome's stroke game. Oh, honestly. Oh uh, wow. Never had it. <laughs> exactly. And when you say that, I'm like, brother, keep searching. <laughs> Look high and low, never give up. I'm about to set out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, about to, I'm about to deploy. If anybody's out there, just for our friend, please. Hey, hey, no, fucking next, next original content skit is has to be Vit dressed up like an adventurer, going on the hunt for good head. Yeah, for for life changing, life changing head. And you said you've never nutted from head, right? I've never have. Oh. That's not, a challenge. Not even, not even when I was like in love with Shorty. No, no, that shit, that shit changes. It's literally a different level of nut because it's <laughs> Dude, like, I'm thinking of a Mr. Beast video, like ten thousand dollars to make my friend nut. <laughs> like first person yeah. to make my friend nut gets ten thousand dollars. <laughs> You're but, bound to find someone that's gonna make you nut, though. Maybe we'll you will. Yeah. yeah, yeah. The first For time that happens, 000, yeah. that shit is like that shit makes you I fucking. Nah, every- but even my my first ex, bro, she would lay there and do that shit for like two hours. And it felt good. 
I mean, no, 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 that's, no, not, see, that's not good. Head. Felt good is like okay, but then when you have the no, no, like yeah, the next the, level, the, the, the level of head that will actually make you come, and you're sitting there being like, "Holy fuck, I might nut." You know, you know, uh, you know what's always funny though. When I tell when I I hooked up with a girl once, and I told her that, and she was like, she, she along the lines of like like not uh, with me on it, yeah, <laughs> basically that. And I looked at her in my head. I just like smirked. I'm like, shut up. <laughs> no, no, no. You know that fucking SpongeBob meme where he's looking down like. Yeah. <laughs> it's like I seen that one time, and the caption was, "When you told her that you've never nutted from head," and she's like, "Let me change that." And then Bro, and sometimes I be getting bored. I have to literally tell them like, "Get up here so we can fuck." Like, I'm, I'm done d- with uh, this. Yeah, I'm done now. Hey, excuse me, I'm done. Do I'd like to get off the ride. Huh? Think that's embarrassing for a girl. Definitely. When, when they're like, yeah, I'll thing. change your life. And yeah. then you're just like, get off. Yeah, yeah. maybe. I don't get know. I don't know. Was get up and quit. Get <laughs> off your knees. <laughs> no, Vince, like, get up and get out. Why <laughs> 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 did you ask him to leave? He's over here like, I just want to be alone now. <laughs> oh, or he, he throws up the performance board, too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm performing so hard. Oh my god! That's Shit. Crazy. Okay. Yeah, but okay. Hey, What's next. But uh-huh. we talk. Question for you. Uh huh. Um, how how many how many um how long into your career were you did you experience that moment? Career of what? What do you think? I think the first time I got head that made me be like maybe I do like head better than sex. It was mm-hmm. I was like fucking like 26, 25. 25. Oh my god, I have... Was that body number 700? <laughs> I'm just kidding. That was a, clearly a joke. Also hey, 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 my year's coming up, though. <laughs> Next year. You're almost there, baby. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but exactly. It's, it's But it's also like an experience thing, right? If you're like in college, you're like 19, fucking 19 year olds, like everyone's bad at That's sex. That's very true. Yeah, like it's like, so like, when I think back on that, I'm like, no wonder we're all bad at sex. <laughs> like, when did you have start having sex? Last year? Like, you know, like mm-hmm. there's just not enough... Uh, so Not, 25 is when you yeah, experienced yeah, yeah. it. And and yeah. Still remember that day like it was my first. <laughs> <laughs> and I you start crying. Yeah, start I, sweating. <laughs> okay, sweating I have a right random now. question. Uh-huh. So you know how porn stars they have a lot of sex. Yeah. So they must have a lot of experience. But they have sex and um they do positions that look good on camera. Yeah. Not necessarily like feels amazing. Yeah. Right? So like how is how does that translate to real life sex? Yeah. Why are you asking me? No, I'm kidding. Anyways, like, I've, I have... Because uh, you, you have friends yeah, that yeah. you may ask questions. No, no. I mean, I'll just say it. Yeah. Like, I've, I've hooked up with porn stars, but they have sex differently from... The big ones, the they- popular ones. Yeah, the ones you know. I got to give my boy for his flowers. Thank you. Johnny Sins. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't name any other male Here ones. Here on Lee. <laughs> yeah. Dread. <laughs> stop, stop. Okay. Everyone, stop. <laughs> <laughs> the women. <laughs> the girl ones. The women hurt. Anyways. Because people say- They have sex very differently from the way they have on camera. Is it like, but is it always good? Not, uh, it's always, I'd say they are freakier than your average girl always, but there's definitely levels to that too. Like there's definitely porn stars that are like fucking- Masters at their craft. Okay. <laughs> no, because even in movies, right? Up. Even in movies, like actor actors and actresses, they say like they're people that kiss really well, but sometimes it doesn't look good on camera. So they have mm. to do kisses where it just looks good on camera, but it doesn't exactly feel good. completely different. And I was like, damn, I was like, it's a lot of the porn positions. Like that should do not. Yeah, it's not stimulating. It's just like you want to show the camera like. Fucking crazy angles shit. and stuff yeah, like the yeah. good angles and stuff, and that's yeah. why I was like, oh, maybe porn stars are good, or yeah. are they like not that good? Sure, you know they're what good. I mean? You know what yeah. I did once? I will. I um after me and this this nice lady that I hooked up with a few times, more than a few times, a lot of times, and then I didn't want to watch her videos ever. But one day I was curious, so I'm like. I, I watched it, and I'm like, it's so different from how she was mm. in real life, you know? Oh. And it was, and I was just like, interesting. <laughs> Imagine you bring that video to her and be like, can you do this one on No, no, me? no, it was better in real life. Oh, like, okay. I could tell she was, I could tell it was what was performance and what was not. That's professional. He's analyzing the game footage. <laughs> I was reviewing the game top footage. <laughs> Damn, doesn't that hurt? It hurted. Yeah. It hurted a lot. <laughs> it hurted. It looked like it hurted her. <laughs> He's smashing his computer screen. <laughs> <laughs> Breaks down in tears. 
<laughs> All right, guys, come on, let's calm down, okay? Hey, I hey, willingly okay. looked it up, okay, guys. Okay, what the it. fuck? I'm not a cook. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that makes you a cook. No, it doesn't. I was just, <laughs> what the fuck? I just always remember We're, sending that, that clip of her <laughs> crying. Okay. Do you I'm have, done with this show. Wait, do you have to cut that out too? Okay, no, okay. No, no, right. He's sweating, guys. No, no, he's dead. He's here. dead ass sweaty. It's just hot in here. Okay, okay. Oh man. Let's get on with the show. <laughs> Fuck. God. Look at Jeremy. Jeremy's crying. Uh, hey, back to the God. show though. Back to the back to the regular <laughs> schedule programming. <laughs> Ah, oh, man. You had quite the adventures, Mr. Wutak. <laughs> I have. I have low-key had quite the adventures. I've lived a colorful life. Uh, <laughs> Anyways. I bet you're weary, traveler. <laughs> <laughs> the quest master. <laughs> you have traveled far and wide, Wutak. I hate you. You're scary, man. Oh. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Oh my god. What's the next question? <laughs> I can't see that far. I know. <laughs> so <laughs> when did you guys first you guys you guys you guys are in love, you would say? Mm-hmm. When did you we're first We're still in our honeymoon phase. Oh, a year in. Yeah. But why are you always on thin ice if you're all in the honeymoon phase? What? Thin ice makes things fun. What are you yeah. Hey, yeah. hey, that's another thing. Ever since I started dating, and y'all don't see this because we have to like cut it out of all the videos and stuff because they're like, I don't want people to know. But uh, they're like, <laughs> they're they have the same type of humor, so they'll yeah. break out into like fucking skits <laughs> in the middle of like us hanging yeah. out. It's fucking hilarious. <laughs> they're also very touchy, touchy yeah. feely. They're so public. They're so obvious if you see them in public. Yeah. But um, when's the first time? Who said I love you first? He did. Who farted in front of the other one first? Oh, whoa. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. That's just, very, that's just, that's just nah, sneaky. Nah, 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 nah. No, I'm, no, I'm it very, doesn't smell. I'm very private about it. His, 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 his fart I go, excuse smell. me, I need to take a toot. And Dude, I'll go he, to the bathroom. I'll turn on all the like loudest noises, the water, play blast, like fucking disturbed out my phone. Disturbed. <laughs> yeah. And I try to time, I'm like, la, 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 la. And I try to time the flush with the fart. He's very cute with it. Like when he needs to like use the restroom, Uh he'd be like, oh, I must take a phone call. (laughs) And then he turns on the music really, really loud. And and yeah, y'all shit in front of each other now. No, No, we don't. Two two bathrooms. And I don't even use, I I made sure that we had two restrooms. I've always thought that was kind of weird. No, it's superior. Like like people, no, 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 no. I'm saying people shitting in front of their, Oh, oh yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Also, nasty. farting in front of them too nasty. is weird too. Nasty. No, I, no, I don't think it's nasty. weird. No, I deadass don't think it's weird. I think that you guys are a little, you know, like different. Uh, to this day, I've never heard her heard her fart. Yeah. So you've never farted in front of him. No, it's it's a silent. <laughs> oh. Have you ever, have you, so you have you you purposely have not I'm farted like, in front of him. Things in here is just like the cat <laughs> and the dog. <laughs> never. That's what it was. And have you ever, have you ever wa- fart? Have you ever walked into the bathroom after she's taking a shit and you were just like, oh. No, no, no. She's Because ex- also with her diet, I feel like that shit would be I, That's what rancid. I thought too. I thought too, but she's extremely clean. I'm extremely okay, well, clean. Clean, yes. But yeah, like, yeah, but, right, I've but never, I've never smelled anything mm. crazy. She's I always like, smell good. She has like four layers of poopery. You know, yeah. you know the fucking yeah, spray, the spray thing? Yeah. I don't need that. <laughs> I don't even use the restroom. <laughs> Girls don't even poop. I don't even know yeah, what this. Exactly. What the point of this is. I'm just imagining she needs to and she's just holding it in like... That's well, why I have so much anger towards him. <laughs> <laughs> if you weren't here, I would have let it out. <laughs> no, what, what was the first time that Jeremy annoyed you? Annoyed me? Yeah, like pissed you off. Like. Fudge. What was our first big fight? <sighs> when was it? Dun, 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 dun. Oh, you guys are such a happy couple. You can't even remember. No, there were so many no, that yeah, I can't I was about to say, just there's, there's so too often. many. Uh, there's a lot. Damn. Um, <sighs> Honestly, I don't, I don't want to talk about it. I think we should it's stay in our mad. honeymoon phase. Yes. Would you guys say that, or Ali, I guess you have no reference. Would you say that you fight more in this relationship than other ones? 
Yeah. Really? 100%. But is it because you guys care more about each other? Oh, 100%. Uh. 100%. Like, I, you, I'm you, i usually, honestly, this is like a toxic trait of mine. But when something pisses me off, I tend to just be like, fuck you. I'm leaving. I'm taking the dog. Bye-bye. <laughs> Give me 10K. And, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> no, because I'm just like, I don't need you. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I, I'm literally like, I don't give a fuck about you. I don't care about you. And like, that's seriously so toxic. I'm literally like, yeah, like if... If you, if I was to leave you today, mm-hmm. I would not miss you ever again. Mm. Damn. That type of shit. Damn. But, with, but with him, I, I, if, I do choose my, I try my best to choose my words wisely uh-huh. because I know how important he is in my life. Mm. So, I mean, yesterday I did say something. Can I say it? Mean. Sure. I did say, get the fuck out of my house. But I was like. Oh, like seriously? Oh yeah. Damn. But 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 I was ho- I but I was in. hoping that he wouldn't leave. That's usually, so fucking you, toxic. No, it it was very toxic. But usually I would literally mean like get the fuck out of my house. Uh-huh. Don't ever fucking text me. Bye. Oh, and, like, like it was like a fight like that. But 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 then once I said that, I was like, fuck, I need to calm down. So I sat on my bed like and then I was like I and went you, back you, at it, but you know, I did come down. I did come down for a little. Like, that's why I was nodding no. I was like, that's huh. not at all what happened. Yeah, I, was like, <laughs> I did get back. No, but yeah. And no. Jeremy's afraid to say his piece when that when that happens. Have you noticed that Jeremy yeah. be just be making faces? He's just a good guy. He's a nice guy. It's <laughs> <laughs> a loud as hell, damn. That shit was loud. Oh man, would you guys say that keeping your um, your uh, relationship private has hurt it, or was it good for y'all? Good. I, has it hurt it in any way? Yeah, like, would you say it was a drawback of any kind or it was better, like, it was a good idea? I think for me, <clears throat> part of the reason why it, it, it could have hurt me a little bit mm-hmm. was because my past relationship, they didn't post me. Mm. And and one of the relationships was because uh, Damn, he was cheating. this was cheating. on another level of not posting you. Yeah, then. he was yeah. cheating. And then the other one was because uh, he was... I mean, I, I'm pretty sure that when some people don't post, sometimes it's like them keeping the options open. Mm. And mm-hmm. so if, because of that trauma, I'm thinking now I have to go to another relationship where I got to keep things private. Mm. I, have so, a, yeah. I have a social media post soft launch oh. an idea. Nice. It should just be our, our feet, bare feet with our toes <laughs> sitting pigeon toes. <laughs> And it's just another pair of feet. Jeremy, no, no, you know it should what? be your toes interlocked. <laughs> oh, for free? That's hilarious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good you can idea. just you can lead with Jeremy's toes, so it's mostly Jeremy's feet. Yeah. <laughs> I have a question. This is more of a discussion topic. Now that you guys are about to be public, do you think that Jeremy's going to get more attention from women on Instagram? I mean, I have his Instagram password, his username. Really? It's my phone. She has access to my phone. Uh, well, I mean, you not saying you have anything to hide. That's yeah. what he thinks. I know everything. Okay. I'm a good boy. Okay. Yeah, I agree. True. I read boy. it. He doesn't have do anything. Are there girls in your DMs right now, would you say? No. Yes, but he doesn't respond to them. Good. Oh, I guess. Good boy. I don't really, I don't even really be looking like that. Like, Interesting. It's true. But okay, so then you know, the, you know the saying that when a dude starts dating an attractive woman, sometimes more girls, it's like that social proof thing. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, mm-hmm. I 100% agree with that. So do you think that... That would happen. Not, I know Jeremy wouldn't act on it. Cause my, that's my, you know, that's my brother right there. He I mean, I just want to tell all you ladies that wants to, you know, want to hit on him. Uh-huh. That I'm crazy strong. She is. And I've I never have seen a her lot lose of, lot of, of weapons strength. at home. Mm. That I don't know how I'm going to use it, but just letting you know. I would never ruin what we have. Okay, then, Jeremy. So then why at L.A. party did you kiss multiple women on the forehead? Whoa, 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 whoa. That was for fourth wall. Oh. I mean, she's, she's mad. She's very mad. And I'm, I'm very apologetic about that. I fucked up. <laughs> okay, well, like, we can get into it now. We can cut to fourth wall right now. <coughs> oh, we're going to get into yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Might as well. By now, you've seen us drink this beautiful drink, and this is Nectar Hard Seltzer, the first Asian-inspired hard seltzer featuring delicious flavors like Asian pear, lychee, mandarin, and yuzu. Now, unlike all those big brands out there that have that disgusting aftertaste, we got rid of it. There is no weird 
aftertaste in this. We actually started Nectar two years ago out of my garage, and because of a viral TikTok, we took off. And because of supporters like you, we've now expanded Nectar into five states, California, Hawaii, Washington, New York, and New Jersey. If you'd like to get a box of Nectar, here are four easy options to choose from. Go to our website, NectarHardSeltzer.com, click on the store locator, and the store closest to you will pop right up. If we're not in any stores near you, next time you're in your favorite store, ask the manager to stock us. You'll be genuinely surprised how well that works. And if we're not in any stores near you yet, or we're not in your city, you can order us online. We ship to 45 states. And if we can't ship to you, send us a text. That tells us where we need to go next. Drink Nectar Hard Seltzer, unique Asian flavors, and no weird aftertaste. Now back to whatever the hell they're talking about. Is kissing someone else on the forehead cheating? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I say no. I'm going to stand on business right now. I'm I don't just, think I'm it's like, I don't kidding. think, I think it's like, uh, maybe kidding. not like the. No, no, I don't think the, it's cheating. Yeah, I but think, it's like, yeah. it's really, I think it's, it's disrespectful. Yeah, it's disrespectful. It's like a violation of yeah. boundaries. Because before, okay, I think the the recent episode, actually the episode that came out like two, three weeks I'm ago. I'm confused. Are we still on fourth wall or? No, no, no. We're <laughs> chilling right now. Yeah. There's no, a regular episode. We'll figure it out later. We were Let's talking about how out. people are, uh, people think that forehead kisses are more intimate now Other than, than like having sex. Yeah. And I kind of agreed on that. I was like, yeah, forehead. No, no, no. I'm like forehead kisses. Ki kisses. kisses. Forehead kisses. Forehead kisses. <laughs> forehead kisses are really intimate. Like that yeah. shit makes me feel safe. That makes me feel like you Comforted. really care about me. Mm -hmm. So when I heard him do that, I was like, Whoa. Hey, well, I did it too. Hey, though. and not only yeah. one, he was handing them bitches uh, okay, out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. There was a girl that was like, I don't want one. He's no, like, you no, want one? Me, Come over here. I already here. know this information. The, those girls came Tell up to me and said- that that's a lie. <laughs> it was funny. It was funny. Okay, honestly- was just out the doghouse. So I was like peeking my head out. It, it was, was like, It was funnier. Like. It was funnier because the girls that I, I was buying the shop for in uh -huh. the LA party uh -huh. was like, oh my God. They're like, Jeremy's over there giving kisses. Esther, I know you like him. You should go get one. And I said, <laughs> obviously I was As not. you hand her a shot, you yeah, just yeah, paid yeah. for it. Yeah, yeah, no, I was obviously, I was not upset at them at all. I thought yeah. it was like, oh, that's so cute yeah. to them. But I was like, oh, is he? Oh, I think yeah. this is your fault though, to be honest. <laughs> Why? Fuck if, 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 if you guys were out. <laughs> Next question. I told Next you, I question. Told <laughs> uh, move on. I just had to stop it right there. A little smart hey, ass. No, but yeah, Loki, if you guys were public to begin with, <laughs> uh, it really all stems from that you guys, for some reason, both of you decided. You Actually, wait, it all stems private. back to Jeremy. Why don't you keep, keep you a secret? Yeah, why is he hiding you from the public? <laughs> So you could kiss girls on the forehead? That's true. Uh, yo, what the fuck, Jeremy? All of a sudden, my arms are swinging. <laughs> I'm kidding. Hey, guys, I feel a little under the weather. I got to leave. I'll be uh, back. Okay, okay. All right, well, how long have we been filming? An hour 22. Oh, beautiful. Damn, y'all be grilling. Does that resolve you, though? Huh? Because it's, it's I know it's been bothering you for a while. So what, what do you need to hear? Or what uh, would you like to hear? I think this is something that I need to just kind of like work through work through myself because he has already apologized and I can't do anything more other than tell him to like buy me a car you know what I mean yeah. but he can't do that so I just have to Fucking let, broke, let it go broke ass. <laughs> Time if he had all. just bought me a car yeah, yeah, I scared. thought you were I thought you were a boss bitch you with this broke guy <laughs> it's like a bet you know <laughs> <laughs> low key you yeah. gambled on that I always said oh sorry I always used to say back when Jeremy was single on the podcast, I'm like, Jeremy's a catch. Y'all don't realize. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. And then, uh, and, boy. Then, and you know, you making an investment right now. This was like Facebook back in like 2006. Mm -hmm. I mean, in the beginning, I was like, oh, how fun would it be to fuck the boss? And then it's not that fun. <laughs> <laughs> no perks. I get, literally no perks. Yeah, it's actually worse probably. Yeah. <laughs> literally, literally, literally no perks. He knows, yeah. he knows when I'm not doing my work. He's like, get up and do your work. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> it's never, it's never, oh, my baby, I'm so sorry. Like, you know, I know work is hard for you. Take the day off. It's like, what the fuck are you? <laughs> no, I never say what the fuck. <laughs> I'm just like, hey, I'm drink joking. your electrolytes, read your book. <laughs> read your book. He gives me homework, yeah. guys. Yeah. That's good. How, in what ways do you feel like Jeremy has made you better? He taught you how to use the internet. That was one. Mm -hmm. That's true. He had, he he did force me to get internet. Yep. And it changed her. She was like, "Oh my god, my it's fault." So like, fast. Yeah. <laughs> true. True. What else? Yeah. What 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 did I teach you? Damn, the question was for you about yeah. Jeremy. But, well, I can't I, reverse the no, question. We will, we will. I, I know, but I can't You're think thinking? of something. Okay, okay so I you. could say uh, I think that Esther is. I think thoughtfulness. Like mm. she she really goes out of her way to take care of the people around her. 
I'm like, damn, I am a fucking hermit. Like, I haven't, like, interacted with humans on that level for a very long time. <laughs> Only through very Zoom long calls. Time. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'd say that. Also, uh, Esther is pretty, like, like, she is patient. Like, yeah, she's very, very patient. I haven't been very patient these days, and I feel very bad about that because that that used to be my really really good quality. Mm. But, but but the thoughtfulness is like ab- above a level that people don't really know. Mm. Like give examples. Okay, this is this is a uh, crazy one. Uh-huh. So uh, I was filming a stupid. So I'm just a bum, and I was sleeping on a bed that I've had since college, like a box spring. I remember your bed, yeah. Yeah, and I and I filmed this. It stu- was embarrassing. I remember I used to be like, bro, you bring women back here? <laughs> oh, yeah, he, brought, he brought me back there. Yeah, yeah. I, was like, I was like, there ain't no way. This is why you get no dates, Jeremy. They could sense your box spring ass fucking attitude. 100%. And uh, I was filming a stupid TikTok video, and I I jumped on the mattress, and it fucked the springs up permanently. So I just had like a, like a dent in the mattress. And she, when she came over that one time, Three weeks later, a fucking bed showed up at my door. Damn. And that's called money risk. <laughs> that's called love bombing. Yeah, yeah. that's love bombing. Yo, no, she love no, bombed no. the shit out of no, you. No, no, but she still does stuff like that all the time. Okay. All the time. Oh, like so she, the romance never died. Yeah, no. I told you we're still in the honeymoon so, phase. Yeah, what don't you get? Honeymoon, yeah, we're still in the honeymoon phase. So I've like, never lasted a honeymoon phase at all. So, long. like, the thing that she's upset about, like, I don't think about food or whatever, like, she's overly thinking about that she's always thinking about my favorite food if she goes out to dinner with her friends she's bringing me back something Mm -hmm. she's always making sure like the fridge is full with things i like or snacks i like because i try to eat very healthy and she knows i'm a bubble boy she's (laughs) also pulled back on the things that she enjoys so that like we could eat healthy Mm -hmm. together or whatever it is Yeah, because imagine me eating a cake i'm like ooh, mm, (laughs) jeremy look at this i know you're on your 36 hours fast but but also, uh, yeah, she fasted with me last last nice. week. Oh, nice. Really? All 36 hours? 24. Nice. Hey, 24 is good enough, man. Don't yeah. push it. 24 is way more. 24 is pretty yeah. good. But um, one day you'll get there one day. I got so skinny after that. I was like, <laughs> I was like please stop. <laughs> <laughs> I have a smidgen. No, 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 I'm so skinny. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so skinny. I could just disappear. I'm so skinny. <laughs> Jeremy, can you see me? Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> can you even see me? She turned sideways. Yeah. Oh, you can't see me. <laughs> I was laying down in bed, like, dude, if I do this one more time, I will disappear. Like, <laughs> just, I'm like, I'm like so itty bitty now. Like, what? Jeremy, like, watch where you lay. Don't lay on me. I know you can't see me. <laughs> Basically, uh, yeah. That's a joke, guys. Telling you it's a hack, dog. Like everyone watching should do a fucking. I would long say she's also a, just like a good a teammate. Mm. She'll she'll do th- we'll do things together, right? Like yeah, I'll mm. beat someone up if he needs someone to cop in. Yeah, church. If I need help packing boxes, she'll help oh, me. That's what like, I meant. Yeah, she's just. <laughs> <laughs> and also, we just have a lot of fun. We do. <laughs> what do you guys even do? Oh, we sleep. <laughs> uh, I, was about to say. I, I see him in my dreams. <laughs> he, we're having fun. She takes a lot of naps. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, hey you, you're lucky I take, take a lot of naps. So yeah, tell him yeah, what yeah. you well, said. Oh, yeah, because I'm just busy as fuck. Oh, so so while nice. you're working, she's sleeping? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or when she falls asleep, I'm like, I can get a bunch of work done. <laughs> yeah, he thanks God that he has a sleepy girlfriend. Oh, uh, yeah. Also, when, when she's sleeping, I take photos of, like... <laughs> I have, like a, like, a collection. I'll show you guys. They're hilarious. Hey, remember, so, remember yeah. when we were talking about the... What were you going to say? I was going to say it's like having a pet cat. Yeah. She's yeah. kind of like a cat. Yeah. Like a hungry ass cat. Uh, a super I'm hungry cat. A fat cat. <laughs> yeah. But uh, remember the fucking triple date we talked about in the two man episode? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and we're like talking about, oh, because I didn't want to mention that <laughs> they were the third couple. <laughs> yeah. And then so, like. Another thing we had to hide. Yeah, we. I'm so sorry, y'all. We keep hiding things from you, but it wasn't our choice. I had to respect my friend's boundaries. It also wasn't my choice, you yeah. guys. Just Behind fucking. the scenes, every day Wu Talk would be yelling, like, you gotta tell them. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Literally, I'd be like, well, I can't lie to them anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell them. You guys, but and seriously, Say, tell your body count for it. No, I'm just kidding. I hope you guys understand. Like, it, it, it does come off weird when, like, people on his side find out that we're dating in a professional setting. Mm. You know, investors and whatnot. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, we did have to keep it private for a while. Mm-hmm. Until, sure we knew, until we knew it was serious. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. So, that, so I makes mean, sense. Yeah, yeah it would have been, it would have been a bad look if you guys broke up. Yeah. So never, never do if that. If Esther breaks up with me, the show is over. So y'all better make sure Esther never breaks up with me. Yeah, it don't. 
Uh, we, we start saying something dumb again. <laughs> uh, next topic. Next topic. Hold back. Yeah, it's gonna be the Vit Wu Talk show after that. <laughs> I, I, didn't, I didn't say what I what I what he changed me. Oh, oh yeah, you remembered thirty five minutes later. No, no, I wanted him to finish. Oh, okay, 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 because I wanted to hear more. My ego. Oh damn, you said a lot of things. Now he that did. I'm thinking about he it, he did. Off. He has made me a better person because I see him working hard. It makes me want to work harder. Mm. And like I have been telling myself that I'm going to do a YouTube channel for like the longest time. And then when I see him like just grinding, I'm just like, I have no excuse. And so now I'm consistent with my YouTube videos. I like, I know it hasn't been that long, but I Those do have like videos, videos that I'm views, editing. Too. Get a lot of views. Get a lot yeah. of views. So <laughs> I'm going to plug my shit in. I actually have something to plug now. Follow me on YouTube, Kanye Wester. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. And Wait, also. Are, where's your, what are you plugging? Uh, <laughs> uh fucking, I don't know, man. Hey, I just, I never came from head. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a Google form. I'm going to link. Yo, uh, he's going to get so much more DMs about... Oh, look, I, I do want to start streaming FIFA because um, I, I just personally don't think I'll ever be able to quit, so I might as well try to monetize it. But <laughs> Literally uh, thousands of dollars down the hole. Yeah, so uh, once... once I'm, I don't want to talk about it, though, because... Like I just haven't started it yet. Mm. So once I start and it becomes an actual routine... Nice. Then I will talk about it. So he's made you more hardworking. Yeah. Inevitable. Also, mm -hmm. Also, I feel like I've, I've never loved someone more than I have loved him. Wow. It's true. So you guys are going to get married, basically. Yeah. Yeah, tomorrow. Who's the best man at your wedding? Uh-oh. Uh, who's the best man at your w wedding? Best man? What the fuck? I'm a woman. <laughs> who's the best man at your wedding? It's gonna Wait, be... do gay marriages not have two best men? Gay marriages? Yeah. Yeah, they do. Okay. So well, two well, best well, men. Why well, they not? Uh, yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm imagining Esther's the one waiting uh, for you to come down the aisle. <laughs> she's she's <Damn>. tearing up. <laughs> she lifts up you my veil. You guys, <laughs> I look pretty in a dress. You know this. Yes. Wouldn't know. <laughs> continue. Um, uh, wait, continue what? what? Oh, continue. Who's going to oh. be your best man? Oh, the best man. Yeah. Because you don't have brothers. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's going to have to be... Sung. Oh, man. Really? That's his cousin. That's his That's cousin. Oh. Just letting the audience I thought know. it was going to be like Gang or Dolzy. No, Sung. I'm Is way closer to Sung. Mm. Did not know that. Yeah. Will we be on the groomsmen? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> just know I'll be standing there during the best man's speech with the one eye rope, just like. <laughs> <laughs> interrupts. He's like, I would like to say mine. <laughs> <laughs> I hey, bro, who's that guy? You probably, you probably <laughs> ride a fire one. Oh, that should be funny as Dude, hell. Dude, I went to a wedding and this guy just riffed it cold. Mm -hmm. And you had the whole, he was walking around with the mic, basically doing crowd work. <laughs> and I was just like, holy shit. Thank God he didn't pick me. <laughs> I still so don't think I've been to a wedding. Was me neither. In my life, yeah. I've been to one as a child. I was the ring bearer for my uncle's wedding, but. Uh, they're lit. If they're Wait, good. Did you go to your mom's? That, that's that don't, barely that count. Don't count. Yeah, it was like that a church service. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it wasn't, it was like not a celebration. Not really. even food? No, it was like we all went to a restaurant after, but like... Uh, small service. Yeah, it was like, just extremely small. Okay. It was private. For sure, for sure. I'm just kind of sad that I wasn't invited. To my mom's wedding? <laughs> yeah, we could have My mom doesn't even know who you are. <laughs> yeah, she could have. <laughs> yeah, why didn't you bring shouldn't, us? Shouldn't she why know who you are? Bro? What do you mean? These are your best friends. friends. I know we can't pull up with him. <laughs> <laughs> it's whatever. Is, I'm, not, I'm not hiding you. It's just, you, know, you understand. Yeah, but you've been to a wedding? Hey, it's, huh? it's, Lydia's it's, wedding. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that's when you were on your little suit phase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he thought, it, well, bro, we just that was weird. You guys have to kiss now. <laughs> yeah, well, I, I was gonna say that too. <laughs> we all have to kiss now. Anyway, <laughs> quick. Wait, why? Get in on this. Wait, why no, do you have to? No, why no, do you guys no, have to kiss? <laughs> Wait, why do you guys have to kiss? <laughs> Why'd you say get in on this, dude? I know what the just, hell. It's just been a magnificent moment. We were we were uh, saying the same things at the same time. Uh -huh. uh. Hey, but overall, how does it feel now that you've uh, you've aired it out? I mean, it feels the same. I've been hitting on him the whole time. <laughs> nothing but new. now you can be like, babe. I call him Jeremy. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you guys have pet names for each other? Yeah, we do. We do. What do you call him? Uh, sometimes Jer Bear. Jer Bear. Jer Bear, mm -hmm. or like. Uh, I call him That's baby, my babe. nickname for him. Okay, relax, relax. <laughs> I called him Jer Bear Relax, first. brother. I, got, I call her Private Esther. I'm like, Private Esther! <laughs> Get At up! Ease. 
Wait, do I say at ease? No, I'm private. That means I'm lower. Yeah, you're lower. Fuck. Yeah, I'm the captain. Do <laughs> you actually call it private? Private Esther? Esther? No, 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 no. What do you call her? I just mommy. Call her, yeah, mommy. Oh. Mommy is oh. your choice of... My brother yeah. just another me. Yeah. <laughs> hey, the do you funniest... Think- <laughs> What are you going to say? When he forgets his wall, he's like, mommy. <laughs> when he like, forgets his what? No, he does this joke. Uh-huh. He does this joke where uh, I pay for him and he like hugs me from the back. <laughs> and he says, I know your debit yeah, yeah. card number. I'll do that in public. <laughs> and I'd be like, fuck, then get the fuck out of here. He's like, he's like, did you forget your pin? Yeah, yeah. I got it. He does that all the, the time in front on, of the bill people. Comes, the bill comes and I'm like, Babe, your card. And he does. This, Where's your card? <laughs> he does this as a as a joke, but like in front of everybody. That's so and funny. I'm just like, bro, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> we be joking. He jokes a lot. Nah, I feel like that is the dynamic here. Yeah, we both joke broke boy around. sugar mommy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but my soon boy, my boy up. Yeah, soon I'll be. Yeah, no, you sugar got daddy. Up. I believe in you. <laughs> I believe Keep buying nectar, please, please. <laughs> hey, if you guys like Esther and you want her to have a good life with her yes. husband, go to H-E-B, go to Ralph's. If we sell a million boxes, you're all invited to the wedding. Hey, y'all should plug your shit now, though. <laughs> it's the brand new year, and with this brand new year, you should be thinking about your health and not having hangovers. 2024, there's no reason you should have hangovers anymore. So this is Super Recovery, my anti-hangover supplement. It uses completely natural, well-researched ingredients. Doctor formulated to stop every part of your hangover, not just things like your headache or hydration. That's a very small part of it. The big part is that you get poison in your liver called acetaldehyde, and our main active ingredient, DHM, helps you process that out five times faster. Everyone here can attest. 100%. It works. It works. Everyone, that, that's why we have a lot of five-star reviews. Go check it out. I'm not lying. TikTok shop, Amazon, my website. Everywhere. Who you gonna trust? Some bozo that's like, oh yeah, look what I formulated, or a oh. guy who's a fucking You're what? you're you're an alcoholic. <laughs> three night going out three nights a week, I would and binge I'm drinking. Not, I'm not going out three nights a week. Recently. No. No. Pr- I wish you would. Yeah, I well, don't go I go out only when I have to. He, used to go he out doesn't go lot. out. I used to. Anyway, wait, 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 this is not a fucking intervention uh, right yeah, now. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. My, business. <laughs> my bad, my bad. You Fuck. are an alcoholic. But anyways, yeah, who you gonna trust? A nerd in a lab coat who went to school for eight years? L- lame. <laughs> <laughs> I hire those guys to, to formulate this. <laughs> I didn't even give one out. I was gonna say, or the alcoholic, but I'm trying to defeat the case. So yeah, anyways, I've worked in alcohol in my life. But yet I'm smart enough to know I have to hire professionals. So we worked with closely with a team of doctors to make this recipe works and it's yep. good for you it's all natural anyways all natural. yeah hit the hit the link down there down there if you want to try it out and there's a 100 percent money back guarantee so if you fucking for some reason by every work of the devil you wake up still not feeling noticeably better then just hit us up and we'll give you your money back oh disclaimer there is a point of no return yeah if you're you just drink. gonna get absolutely blacked out and you're throwing up that's the funniest part is when people are like puking it's like you li- i can see the pills in your puke right there Ugh, no ew. shit it's not gonna work but uh, but yeah. Yep. So don't throw up, and don't drink to the point of throwing up. That's just bad for you. Yep. I'm trying to think of like a a, a jingle I could come in with. <laughs> Nectar hard seltzer. Uh, just real quick, we are now uh, launching the new pack, and by the time you hear this, we should be now in Hawaii, California, Texas, Washington. Go to the store locator, buy it, and if you're sick of all that old, boring, hard seltzer, lime, grapefruit, mango with that weird aftertaste, we've cured it. Also, you guys gave us the feedback. You wanted bolder and sweeter, and so that's what we did. So go out and get the new pack, and just a hint, I think because it's January, I can slowly announce this. We have a whole brand new innovation coming. Brand new innovation. It's not going to be a hard seltzer, so if you want to be alerted about that, Join the number. It's in the description. Go find a box. And if, oh, also, what I need is your help. Anytime you see a store shelf out of stock, take a photo, send it to the number, tell me the address of the store. You got to make sure that you talk to an employee and they confirm that there's nothing in the back or it's not in the store. Sometimes it's, they put it around a different part of the store. And if that is confirmed, I will send you some stickers, some rare nectar stickers. Look, look, look. It's cute little stickers. All right. I'll send. I'll send some to you. Welcome back to everybody's segment. What? Everybody's segment. Sorry, everybody's favorite segment. <laughs> this guy forgot how to speak English. Welcome back to everybody's favorite segment. 
Dollar Store Therapy. Now we're going to do that again. No, no, no. Just, go, hey, just keep it moving. <laughs> if you're a guy, if you're talking to a guy. Oh, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Let's, uh, let's explain the segment real fast. Damn. Oh, yeah. Sorry. So these are questions submitted from our audience, and you're talking to the four smartest people in the entire world. There's nobody smarter than us, and we're going to give you some very cheap advice. <laughs> if you're... Question number one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Also, you... If you're on our exclusive bonus content platform, we prioritize your questions there first. So, just know. Just know. That's where you. That's where you go if you wanna. If you want us to answer your questions for certain. Okay. Question number one. If you're talking to a guy and they ask you if you want if you want to have a threesome with their guy best friend, does that mean they're not serious about you? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, that's yeah. Crazy. I mean, how did he say? They're, because they're it in love like, with each other. Yeah. So it's a guy and a guy, yeah, and it's guy best friend. It's a guy. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. It's a guy asking the girl. Yep, yep. Do you want to have a threesome with me and my friend? That's like my guy time. friend, right? Yeah, yeah. That's like me finding someone I want to date, but then being like, "Yo, do you want to? Yo, you want you want Wu Talk to fuck you <laughs> with me there too? Yeah. Fucking you? That's crazy. No. Fuck my boy Wu Talk with me. <laughs> Sorry, little silly gooses. <laughs> we were we did not mean to hold that secret for very long, but there was reasons why we had to. So please forgive us. Anyways, if you guys want to watch Jeremy and Esther's date. Where everyone on the exclusive content have already known that they're dating because we revealed it already. Weeks ago. Weeks ago. So, ha, you're late because you don't like to support our show. So, you can still do that right now under the influence.show and watch them go on a date. Are these sold out by now? Yeah. Okay. If you missed out, join the... Uh <laughs> we need to make like an email list. Yeah, yeah, yeah something yeah, like that. Don't worry, my list is one. But, but hey, in the next coming year or yeah. this year, we're going to be doing four capsule collections, all limited drops. Be ready. This was a limited drop. We only made 400. Brando designed them. They're amazing. Beautiful. Yes. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, wish Jeremy and Esther good luck now that they're now a public couple. And yeah, goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Hey guys, we're Under the Influence, and if you're enjoying our clips and you want to see the full episodes, you can go to our website. We have them all linked to every audio streaming platform and YouTube. If you like, comment, and subscribe over there, it really helps us out. Please, we haven't paid the rent in months. If you're looking for us or any of the guests, we always tag them. Also, if you have any topics or questions you want to ask us, go to our website or text this number on the screen. If you're feeling thirsty, drink Nectar, Nectar Hard, Hard Seltzer. Seltzer. Delicious Asian flavors and no weird aftertaste. We ship to 45 states. Use code UTI15 at checkout on our website for 15% off your first box. And if you want some of the best bartending tools money can buy, you can use the same code UTI15 on barchemistry.com for 15% off. Thank you guys for your support. We really appreciate it. And if you leave mean comments, please stop. They really hurt our feelings. But if you don't, we love you.